Hi lovelies, I know my camera is about to overheat so I kind of have to talk to you guys quickly But welcome to my channel, it is Ariana Cheyenne And I am back with a vlog And today's vlog is just going to be a day in my life uh, I will probably take the vlog on until tomorrow Just because it's like, it's two already And I know I'm not going to get everything I need to get done today So some things are going to go into tomorrow but right now i'm on my way to get a facial by my girl esthetician bay i'm gonna tag her in my description box so that you guys can go book with my girl also i just have to run some errands pick up some things i put it in my phone so that i know exactly what i'm going to get because if i don't do that i will forget so right now it is 2 16 my appointment is at 2 30 i am late wasn't supposed to be late but i am and that's okay um, as y'all seen in like the beginning of the video, I did a little montage. I did my lashes. Your girl did her lashes. Just because like, I'm the type of person where this car is going up this hill so slow. What? I'm the type of person where if I can do it myself, I'm gonna do it. I put these clip-ins myself. I did my own lashes. I do my own nails. Speaking of nails, I need to go get my press-ons. Because I have these press-ons on only for these four fingers and I need to get I just took these off yesterday but um, yeah I'm not I'm only gonna get my lashes done for occasions like trips and birthday and stuff like that other than that I will be doing my lashes by myself because lash extensions are a bill baby okay so I'll see you guys more when oh I forgot to get me some water Dang, I'm gonna just drink the water I have. I got two water bottles. I got a couple of water bottles in here. I'm gonna drink what I can until I can go to the gas station or something. Because I'm fasting and I need to be drinking water in between the time I'm hungry. Yesterday I drank um, water every time I wanted to snack on something or if I was hungry and it just worked out so well.
so I just got done with my um I just got done with my facial it was a 10 out of a 10 highly recommend um my skin has kind of been like really bad lately just because of me doing nails for so long every day and not having not having moisturizers toners the proper things to wash my face i'm gonna go in the car and talk to you guys a little bit more about it because i'm in the bathroom right now it's just so cute in here but we're about to go get something to eat and i'm gonna see if it's a target over here i'm sure it is so let's go yeah i know how i just said i'm gonna go to target when i get out of here i don't know if you guys can see but it's right there so target here we come i only have to really get um same pads and tampons and some honey pot gear so that's what i'm about to go do now i'm about to go into target right now i just got here it's hella traffic it is 4 4 30 Tuesday, March 29th, and there's a lot going on on my phone. Whoa. Um, anyway, I'm at Target. Uh, uh, shortly after Target, I am going to go get me something to eat. I was saying there's a whole lot of traffic, like a whole, whole lot of traffic. Um, right now it says I'll get home in 40 minutes, which is crazy to me. Um, can we talk about this skin though? Like Jordan 8. She ate and left no crumbs. I actually need to make a record a video. I was just talking to you guys, but I wasn't recording. That's tough. Um, okay. So, see, they have way more stuff. I wish they had the blue one because the blue one is for sensitive skin. I think I'm just gonna get the, the lavender rose panty spray, the calming one, honey pot, everyday liners. I like them in boxes. Just say excuse me, that's it. Anyway, um, <clears throat> I'm gonna get these liners and tampons. Uh, I need super, I need super, super. I feel like I'm just gonna get these two because I'm gonna need them anyway. Um, these are, I don't know what this L brand is. I heard it was really good though. Um, 100% organic cotton core tampons. The Tampex also has a, um, some pure cotton, 100% organic. Okay, they're both seven dollars. I'll figure out. I'll either get them both, or I'll either get them both, or I'll just get one of them, and then I got time to figure that out. I did not grab my bag. <laughs> it's mine. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm glad you came back for you. <laughs> Why did I forget my entire freaking bag? Like. So as you see in the video, um, I got 
what I got. I'm gonna show you now, so I ain't gotta show you at the house. Even though you might already know. So I ended up getting these, and the reason why I ended up getting these ones instead of the other ones is because these came with 30 and the other ones came with 24. They were both like 750 ish. I'm like, well damn. Here's the tiebreaker right here. The price. I mean the amount that's in there. 30 to 24. I also got the honey pot. Um overnight cotton pads. Yeah. Cotton pads. Um, I usually only work um pads at night, really. I wear them during the day, but really at night. Like just really at night. I also got everyday liners. So these are I'm just gonna put these. Yeah, I'm just gonna put these on like, you know, some days. If you know Honey Pot, you know like your first initial experience is a little tingly and you get a little nervous if you don't know if that is what it's for or not. We're about to go to this. Maybe I should have put it in my GPS before I pulled out, but it's called, it's really literally like down the street but I'm gonna put it in the GPS just in case I don't ever come to this area over here but it's really pretty I don't know if I'll move to somewhere over here because it's it seems like it's like hella busy all the time but it is really pretty over here it's really vibey I should say there's a taco mac right here too I love that so I'm back from eating the food was good so now I'm about to go to Ulta and TJ Maxx um I so like I was just thinking to myself and <sighs> so much traffic honestly I am not the type of person that likes to spend money um I have to I have to learn that it's okay to treat yourself sometimes I have to learn that it's okay to treat yourself like that's just one thing that I've I'm trying to learn for myself is you work so hard you don't have you know a whole bunch of friends you don't go out a lot but it's okay to treat yourself it's okay to take yourself to get something to eat it's okay to pay for a facial it's okay to pay to get your nails done even though I do nails I always think to myself why would I go get my nails done when I can do them myself but something as simple as going to get your nails done paying somebody to service you instead of you being the server all the time it just makes you feel 10 times better it's okay and I, like I said I'm learning that and I hate to spend money I'm not the type of girl that's like I'll spend a check and get it right back no I'm like okay if I spend this money if I didn't spend this money today I would have so much more than da 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 if that makes sense like I hate counting my money and seeing what I spent because I'm like dang I didn't have to spend that today but at the same time treating yourself is healthy treating yourself is I don't know it just it just builds your confidence up so much it's just it's just a great feeling so I just wanted to come over here and say, come on here and say, if you are feeling a way, if somebody is making you feel a way, or if you just want to get out, treat yourself. If you even have to treat yourself to some freaking ice cream, like, just go treat yourself to something. We all work hard, and it's, you can just treat yourself. Social media tends to influence a lot of people in the right ways and in the wrong ways sometimes social media it has good influence on you sometimes it has really bad influence on you um i try to i try not to let it have a bad influence on me however social media is social media and if you continue to see certain things you're going to think in your head well damn why am i not doing that 
However, everybody's life is different. Everybody's path is different and all that. So you cannot expect for your life to be as the same as somebody else's especially for girls like us in in the ages of from like 18 to damn 30 it's so much that you see and it's so influencing and you don't know what type of influence it will have on you so i just wanted to come on here and say that i'm gonna see you guys at tj maxx reason for going to tj maxx in particular is because i didn't know ugh sold towels and I wanted to go find some Ugg towels like that is just so what like oh I knew they had oh my god these freaking houses what the? let me slow down and take a look at some of these dang bro these folks is living in luxury see this is what I manifest I knew they had sheets and comforters and stuff like that, but I did not know they had towels, so I wanna go see what the towels are about. And then I also wanna get some claw clips. So yeah, I'm gonna see you guys when I get there. Am I the only one that thinks that something, sometimes certain Instagram captures are corny? Like I have this picture that I took today that I wanna post and the caption that I was gonna choose was gonna say sweatpants hair tied. I literally have on sweatpants and my hair is in point up. But like, is that corny? Somebody let me know. Let's go in there, girl. Let me put my mask on because I don't need no extra judgment. I'm literally going in there to get some brow freeze. And that's it. And I'm coming right out. I don't need nothing else. Okay, I do want to get a MAC pencil. My sister had one. $19 for a lint pencil, is it worth it? Let me call my sister and ask. So, I remember, um, I remember using your MAC pencil, and I just want to know, if is it, is it worth it for $19, $20? Yes, and it's a big one, so I mean, you gonna get it, I mean, you gotta think you sharpening that just the whole time. I'ma just get it, fuck it, you only live once. Where you at? Ulta. Do they have those little hand sanitizer things? Oh! Check that out. Oh! Bitch, let me, let me, let me, actually, let me see. This is cute as hell. What is this for? What are these brushes for? So I found the stuff, but I did not see the brow freeze. Uh, honestly, I might, might think Ulta just might be better than Sephora. Now that they have Rihanna's stuff, I think I might give it to them because before, before I never really went into Ulta because they didn't have any Fenty. And now they do. So to me, to me, Ulta is better than Sephora. It's just so much needed stuff in there. Plus some, like it's just so much stuff in there. So, Anyway, um, I went in there. They did not have the brow freeds, but they did have this eyebrow gel, this mini eyebrow gel for $9. And I just got it because I'm not going anywhere else to get this brow gel, brow freeze. And um, it's not on Amazon. So I was like, okay, well, I can't get it now. So I'm going to just get it, get this replacement type of thing and then get the brow freeze whenever I can. Um, there was this Real Techniques of makeup brush package that I wanted to get. It was $30. And in my head, I was saying, if I'm going to go, if I'm going to get this Real Techniques um, brush set, I'm not going to go into uh, TJ Maxx. But I really wanted to come into TJ Maxx. So I just put it back and I was just prioritizing my moolahs and what I wanted to come in here for. And if honestly, if they don't have it, if they don't have what I'm looking for, I'm gonna go ahead and just go home. I'm not even gonna, I'm gonna look for the claw clips and the Ugg towels. And if they don't have them, I'm gonna go. Because honestly, I'm ready to go home and I've spent enough money. Okay, let's go. Okay, oh, and you know how you got, you know how I was talking to you guys about my caption? So I ended up putting the caption. And let me show you guys. Okay, so, and it says that picture, and it's like, and I said sweatpants hair tied. 
So that's interesting. But okay, let's go straight to where we need to go. No extra stops. That's your peso. Keep your eyes on the prize. Keep your eyes on the prize. I don't. I don't see him. Somebody go back and get the brush. Peace out, TJ Maxx. You ain't had nothing for me. I think I'm just gonna go home. Maybe treat myself to those makeup brushes another week. Bye, y'all. Good bye. Hey, girls. So I'm back home. And right now my mother and I are about to do some hookah. off because I've been kind of having an emotional morning but I'm not gonna let that ruin my day I um, mean it's like 12 55 right now um just I put some clothes in the washer made my bed ate some breakfast did all that like I said I'm fasting so I didn't eat until 11 I stopped eating at 7 p.m. so that's what I have been doing right now I'm about to get in the shower because I don't know what today holds I don't know what today holds I kind of want to go to like a coffee shop or a restaurant and edit or take my dog to the belt line i don't really know what i want to do but i do want to just kind of chill for today i have a long two days ahead of me on thursday and friday i have five appointments tomorrow six appointments on friday so that's 11 appointments in two days and that's just gonna like I know this is about to be TMI, but have y'all ever had a booty cramp while you're on your cycle? I feel like they're the worst type of cramps because why are you annoying me? But anyway, um, right now I'm about to nair my body because it's very, it's getting hot outside and I'm hairy. Like I'm going to nair my arms, my underarms and my legs. I'm not going to do my woman down there my nunu down there because i am still on my cycle and i think that just defeats the purpose but i don't know how much um nair and stuff i do have so i use the nair nourish shower power now i used to get waxes guys but honestly i don't think i can bear the pain of waxes anymore but I'm gonna see you guys when I get out of the shower and I'll let you guys know what I'm doing because like I said, I don't know what I'm doing, but we'll just have to see what today has in store for us, so. Okay, so I'm out of the shower, I shaved, I washed everything, I did everything, girl. But I wanted to come on here and review this brow gel with you guys. So I definitely don't like it more than the um brow freeze i don't like it more than the brow freeze at all but 
it's good for what it's worth. Also, I decided that I'm just gonna stay in the house and create my logo and edit and do laundry and just be productive. Um, I'm not gonna prolong this vlog too much because um, like I said, it was really only supposed to be a one day vlog and then I was just gonna put in whatever I was doing today, but I'm not doing anything today for real, so um yeah so i'm about to go edit now i like to edit with these glasses on they're blue light glasses so i only put them on at night or when i am editing doing homework anything of that sort because the blue light makes and like screens makes my <sighs> eyes hurt and my head hurt so honestly i might not be out here long because um i'm not allergic to pollen but bro it's literally pollen everywhere and like I just got out here and there's pollen on my laptop and all my stuff and I used to have a reaction to pollen but I don't anymore and if I go back in my house and I'm coughing or sneezing I'm gonna be really mad because I'm stupid for coming out here but I'm not allergic to it so not like that anyway Okay, so I really want to create my, um, I really want to go ahead and create my intro first because I have an intro, but all the intros I have are really like, let me take this off for a second. All the intros I have are really just like, Nugget, what do you eat? Oh my God, it's piling all over his lips. Ah! Look at my dog's lips. Okay, it's so pretty out here, but the pollen is just irritating. And if I hear the wind, I'm sorry, I don't have my um thingy on there. I think I have made an executive position, I mean decision, to go back in the house. I tried to be cute, come out here, get some fresh air, and it's just not working. So... And there's like three bumblebees right here. Like y'all don't waste no time. They don't waste no time coming out here. That's four. Four. My dog got pollen on his lips. My laptop got pollen on it already. My camera lens about to have pollen. My glasses already have pollen on them. I'm just about to go in. It's like pollen is just like, I wish there was like a pollen camera where you can see where the pollen is. And I just know it's everywhere. So I'm just gonna go inside. I'm not even gonna play, play myself.
so as y'all seen i just did the intro that was my first like time doing an intro if you've been watching my channel if you've been like if you've seen i've had like four intros the first one i had i first got my channel somebody made it it was cute it wasn't really it was too childish then my second one i got it was really cute but the problem is the pictures are too old and then the music that she put on it was copyrighted cancel that out the third one I got, I tried to go really simple, but I feel like it was too simple for my own liking. And then now, uh, like every time I look, every time I look back at it, I'm just like, ew, this was disgusting. The fourth one I had was one of my favorites. Um, the music that I put on it was my cousin's uh, like snippet of music, which was really cute, but it was also still a little bit too much with some older pictures. And then this last one, this this one before the one I made, this one that I had, I didn't, I forgot I even had. This is so boring. I just, it's so ugly. Look at it. I never even put this on my channel because it was so ugly. Like, boring. That was just boring. So I'm, I'm gonna try to show y'all all of them so that y'all can see why I decided to take it the way that I did. So my first one, okay. So this one was actually pretty cute. This is like my first intro. However, my name is definitely not Simply Ari anymore on YouTube. So yeah, I'm gonna show y'all though. So this is the first one. Okay, that was my very first intro. And then, here was now my now when you see this I had to take the music off of this intro because the girl that made it did not let me know at this time I didn't know about copyright like copyright that much and she put this song on there and I got copyrighted for it so I just had to take it off of my whole entire video but this is the second one It's cute, but it's very old pictures, pictures from like two years ago, copyrighted. And I just think it was a little too much. It was just too much going on. So didn't like that one. So then my third and fourth one, third and fourth one was kind of the same, but okay. So here is the third one. It was cute. It was cute. The butterflies, eh. It was cute. It was too simple though, like, it was too simple. So then I actually made that girl send me two versions of that intro without the butterflies. So I got both of those and she didn't charge me to have both of them because it was pretty much the same thing just without the um, butterflies. So I'm gonna show you that one, okay. So this is the same one as the one, one with the butterflies, just without. Once again, way too slow. It just kind of made me tired. If you watch Aaliyah's face, then you know that Aaliyah's face has a intro similar to that. It just says Aaliyah's face and that's it. And I wanted to do that for mine, but I was like, it just, it's not me. Like, it's just not me. So then this last one. That one is really cute. I love it. I'm gonna still keep it just in case I wanna switch it up sometimes. However, it was just too much, which is way too freaking much. And then lastly, I got this one made, never used it. It's so ugly and I'm mad that I paid for it. So here is the one that I just never used. I'm disappointed in it. I'm mad that I paid for it. And yeah. This junk is so ugly and when she sent it to me, I couldn't do nothing but not respond. Like I didn't say thank you. I didn't say, I didn't ask for any changes. 
I was I I was just like you know this was a fail I'm gonna use the pink one that I have um the one I told y'all I like that I'll still use I'm gonna just use that one and keep it pushing because this is hideous so then I just came up with the idea to just figure out a way to create my own intro and I feel like this is the best one I've ever had Real cute, real simple, real sassy. Okay, perfect. Right now, guys, I am eating a lettuce wrap with some chips, with some pickles to the side, and some peppers. So, yeah. I'll probably see you guys. I don't know when. Hi, guys. So, I'm back in my room, and before I close the video, I wanted to show you guys, um... Y'all seen the hand sanitizer I got from Ulta yesterday, but you didn't see it outside of the package. So here's this little cute hand sanitizer. I first seen this hand sanitizer on freaking um, TikTok and I was like, this is so freaking cute. But it's just, it's a power mist hand sanitizer. And it smells really, mm, it smells really good. This one smells like watermelon and then the other with the green one smells like aloe, which both of them are cool i don't mind either or but the second thing i wanted to show you guys this is my first time opening these up myself i just got it in the mail these are my sweat pads for my underarms so i have hyper hydrosis that's what it's called um where i just sweat excessively like i could be freezing cold but these underarms is hot and sweaty now don't be musty but i'll be sweaty and that's just annoying you know I, i've overpopulated my closet and wardrobe with black and i'm just tired so i wanted to get these pads this is the pad and i guess you do like that and you put it on the shirt so you put it on like the sleeve of your shirt i'm excited to see i've been meaning to buy them and i just never got to buying them so I'm going to see what those are talking about. I have a shit ton of laundry. I got laundry in there and then all of this on my bed. So I'm about to do that now. Yeah, if you got to the end of this video, thank you so, 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 so much for watching. Um, it wasn't supposed to be this long of a vlog, but I'm going to stop rambling because it's the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching, like I said, and I'll see you guys in my next one.